or whatever. Yeah. So he's like very hard to hit while he's dashing around. But uh, yeah, I mean, really solid pick from Gohan. Very solid switch as well because exactly. we saw I think the snake. He was only snake game one, right? Yeah. I think then it was he, only game he, one. Then he pivoted into a uh, you know Joker. Got to drop the pivot. TFT, let's go. <laughs> Sometimes you got to pivot correctly, you know what I'm saying? You yes. got to know when and, and he, where. He knew, he knew. Yeah. He played so well. I'm actually, I'm thoroughly enjoying Gohan's play. Yeah, no, he, even Kirifax, I felt like everyone's just playing very solid. Yes. And it's more so just like, well, I played way more solid, especially with all the FD we've been seeing. Like, I've just been playing way, whoever wins is like, well, I played more solid on my ledge traps kind yes. of thing. I feel but, like it's one of those sets where it's like, you know, Kira lost, but... I hope he's not being too hard on himself. That was a good set. Yeah, and he's still in this. He's still in the exactly, losers. He can still bring this back. Exactly. And he's you don't, you don't want to get tilted going in the losers. Yeah. He'll be playing the winner of this set, which is Meteor going the Golden Mark. Yeah, so we, we, didn't, we didn't see any losers quarters, but we yes. do have the uh, loser semis. We, bo we saw know, both of these guys in winners. Yes, these are always oh, dead. Wow. That's like the Hunsa, but for Marth. Yeah, he and they get him like center stage at 100. Yeah, if you get the tipper, it's hard to hit because Dancing Blade is not as consistent as it yeah, was in Smash 4. It's, it's pretty bad. RIP, I'll definitely play this character if it was. But um, if when you do get it, uh, it's very, very powerful. Exactly. A lot of people thought there was just no tipper on for it before a long time, like when the game dropped. And then people wait, were like, saw. He just, he just chased the stitch and threw an aerial out at it. If he missed, it was dead. Wow. That was a brave option. Very brave soul. And it looks like we have a obvious counter pick coming out here from Meteor. Um, we didn't see any Marth all day. Pretty much just saw the uh, the Sonic. What was the other character we played in Winners? I'm trying hard to remember too, man. Wolf. Yeah, the Wolf and the Ooh. Wolf and Sonic. But now we we see uh see the Marth here for Peach. And Marth, a character kind of everyone thought he sucked. And I'm I'm seeing a lot more of him. Like people playing him more in friendlies or just yeah. even like in tournament. I feel like a part of it is. Marth has a little more creativity than Lucina. Right, because you have like the tipper follow-ups and then the, like the weak hit follow-ups. Oh, you can have that's oh. an unfortunate SD. I don't know if he tried to save him or not. I'm going to go with he did because there's no reason why he should be down there trying to up Yeah. But unfortunate side B instead of up B in there. And especially on a stage such as this. Yeah, yeah, exactly. With like the scooted in area where you can just die on the bottom. It yeah. definitely doesn't help you out. But yeah, Marth definitely, okay, that side B will kill. But Marth, kind of like Roy in a sense, where like you have follows from Sour Hit, and then you yes. also have follows from Tipper Hit. So you got to like know exactly. It can be a, I think it can be more fun to play in general yeah. than Lucina, because Lucina's just like, I'm, I'm hit you. I do you. this, I do that. I hit you with sword. Like, yeah. I hit you with sword, I win. Like, awesome. You know what I mean? Like, Marth is a little bit more intricate, because you want to kind of like go for the tip of the sword, because you get exactly, more rewarded exactly. for better spacing. And just off of that, you know, if you're having more fun with the character, you're probably going to play more. Yeah, oh, exactly. this is a rough situation. Oh, man, no double jump or no float as well, right? The oh, wow, that was... <laughs> he tried to kill him with his head, but it doesn't have a hitbox. <laughs> I feel like Fair was the play because Fair, like, comes up and over, right? I feel like... There was, there was a... A lot of other things he could have done, or even line up for Bear. Yeah, but he decided, you know, I want to win my way. And he still has an amazing lead. Like, th there's definite room to try to go for that. There's definitely know? there's definite room for error here. Like, and even if he SDs right there, like, he still has a 150% lead. Yeah. Like, yeah. you know, I tried to nair, I SD'd right there, but, you know, I still got the nice hair. I'm Yo, but was it there. C stick nair? No, I'm kidding. It was, it, but now you can say buffer nair. Yo, I wanted fair, but I got buffer nair. Oh, <laughs> uh, maybe, yeah. Just the uh, attack cancel. Yeah, th that, that's like, there's always some trying to tragic, like, nair situation. But the tipper four tilt. Very solid, like, looked like it anti-aired him there. Yeah, I'm surprised it hit, and I'm surprised it tipped. But it's like we said earlier, the kill screen gives you all the time to process that information. Yeah. And Meteor probably processed that before we did, taking game one pretty clean. Yeah, yeah very solid, and I mean, almost very, like, Cloud-esque forward tilt. You know, like, I'm corner pressuring you. I'm in range of a forward tilt. I'm in range for a ground option that can kill. I'm going to, like... Feel, I'm gonna try to read like a jump option or a dash in option yeah. and just like snuff you out. It's and really solid stuff in here. I was gonna point out how Houston does have a counterfeit character. Yeah, he has the Wii Fit. Exactly. And it, it wasn't looking too hot. I mean, Peach can struggle with disjoints. Peach exactly. is a character that she doesn't want you to exactly to have like good air to air. She yeah. wants you to be like she wants to fight more grounded um, opponents. And, like, she wants to be the one pressuring air to ground. Yes. If Peach can pressure air to ground, she's really, really good. But if, if someone else has, like, disjoints or really good air to air, that's where Peach they're can kind of struggle. Her. Yeah, they're going to swat her out of the air. They're, they're going to force Peach to either float at full hop or float at ground level. Yes. Not anywhere in between because it's not going to be as strong. And then Peach is still good in those situations, but she's just not as strong. Another thing, like, Peach can kind of camp, but turnips aren't, like, the hottest. While we fit, you know, 
You got the ball. Oh, you got, you, got <laughs> you definitely got way more things to throw. You got the deep breathing. The, the, you got the hoops. Yeah, exactly. Even like deep breathing is like, okay, we're, we're chilling. Heal, buff myself, bam. Wow, that oh, was. Wow. With the up air too. Yes. Was that from down air? From down air. Yeah. Was that like the, the spike? Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he spiked him back. <laughs> He's like, you spike me with your sword, I'm going to spike this ball right Was now. that the down air that sent him straight up yes, or the yes, spike yes. one? Okay, okay. Well, uh, the spike one. Like, oh, all, so off the ground, ground off the ground, ground yes. Okay, okay. Because there's that down air that, like, just hits you straight up, which is weird. Yeah. It's in this game. Okay, so back to Nooch here and pretty even game. We've got two stocks apiece, pretty much mid percentage here for both of our players. And that is another thing Houston has, a very good crouch coming out from We Fit. Yeah. Can kind of duck under some of these falling arrows yeah, that we like trying to force throw sorties to either place a very low grounded aerial or just do nothing. That could have killed. Yep. And another thing about We Fit is uh, don't be touching that shield from behind. Yes. If you touch We Fit's shield from the behind, back uh, the air. back air is so fast. It actually hits pretty low. Like, there's some characters that can pancake under it, like Pikachu, Pichu. But other than that, like you're going you're, to get hit. You're gonna you're get gonna hit. Die. If they're ready to punish out a shield, you're going to get hit. Whoa, I thought he was going to punish the counter. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he, he definitely could have. But it looked like he went into, like, another, like, oh, I'm going to charge or reposition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of just like, you know, if this hits, if it hits. If it doesn't, you know, let me keep my stage control. Yeah, okay. one, one random thing I keep thinking of. Imagine if we fit had, like, the hoops being, like, Cypher, where it just flies through the stage. Oh, and it keeps going <laughs> yeah. up? That would make the move a lot better. Yes. Because um, that up B is pretty... Like, it's decent, but Reefit's recovery is better, is good because of a lot of other options. But yes. I'm going to catch you autopiloting that uh, hitter, I think is the move called, yeah. the side B. And really good stuff. Meteor fast fell underneath it and then scooped up and got the forward air. But nonetheless, man, Houston always keeping it close, just getting the revenge stock right off the bat. I love seeing these uh, anti-air dash attacks where it's like, oh, you're lining over here? I'm hitting you over there. Like, where are you going? Yeah, and now, like, Weepit's dash attack is very solid, and it kills now. Yes. I'm glad they, I, I'm gl I'm honestly glad they added that option for a lot of these characters, having killing dash attacks, because it promotes, like, zone breaking. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, at higher percent, I feel like in Smash, Ooh! what? What? No way. That almost killed. That almost killed. Down air? Oh, the counter. Oh, he might be dead. He might be dead. Oh, wait. He goes high, though. That was a really good high, because if he went low, he could have got spiked from down air. Yes. That almost killed, dude. Yeah. And that was like behind Marth. Like, where was the sword? Uh, well, you know, <laughs> it was a wind box. The so tip it was a of the box. hilt, bro. Tip of the hilt. Marth used wind <laughs> arts. He slashed the air. <laughs> okay, man. Okay, but right now Houston has the rage. Oh, He's I'm getting surprised the he held on to the deep breathing. He didn't want it yet. Yeah, he canceled it out and he wanted to catch the landing instead. Yeah. Honestly, he might have caught smart. the landing because he baited out the deep breathing. Ooh, you're or right. Or with the deep right. breathing, yeah. Uh-oh, this is close. He tried to back around the first jab, but the shield pressure. Yep, yep. <gasps> oh, you can't shield grab. We fit. <laughs> there it is, the shield break. And let me hook you up with this tipper, neutral B. And man, did I see my man Houston fly out so quick on that stock meteor. Oh, oh, you saw him? Yeah, you're right, I, man. I, I I even, that, was instant, <laughs> that was instant transportation right there, man. Damn, Dang. meteor with a clean 2-0 lead. Yeah, no matter what character Houston's throwing at him, Meteor's Marth is looking very, very clean. Yes. And, uh, I mean, it's just such a treat because it's not a character we get to see too often, honestly, yeah. at, at this level of play. Um, I definitely I definitely feel like some of the other top players could pick up Marth as well, but definitely a character that it can be scary committing to as a professional player because it's like, man, no one else is really doing it, so, like... Yeah, you, you have uh, to learn it on your own. <laughs> right, exactly. You and know. then, like, when, when especially when you have characters like Lucina, Ooh. more consistent options to pick, you know what I mean? Yes. Good delays. I like yeah, that. Yeah. Another thing, Marth. Marth can really chase Weep at off stage. You know? The disjoint off stage yes, is like very, very you clean. Just, you run after her and you're like, you know, I know you have header. I know you can kind of float around. Dang, but that tip, that I can float around too. Wow, man. Meteor is not letting this man breathe right now. Yeah. So many disjointed hitboxes up in his face. We, saw, we saw his wolf earlier. You saw what he was going for. Him. Yeah. <laughs> you're right. You're right. And even in Smash 4, Ooh. oh! Meteor was an aggressive Sonic in Smash 4. He, oh, oh, he's dead, he's dead. No he's way. Dead. Off, They're dead. <laughs> They're dead. Off the backboard? Yeah. Yo, he, hit him, he hit him with the backboard, though. Snipe. Wow. And a, just right when he got hit after the double jump, it was, it was a clean hit. Like, it was just over. I love situations like that where it's kind of like, you know, I cheese you, but let, let's start fresh. Yeah, yeah. You, you know what? You got the stock too. Yeah. Man. 
You've been doing good. <laughs> Let, let's start. Let's start. Let's play Smash Four for a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two yeah, star yeah, game. Two yeah, star yeah game. we're playing a two star <laughs> game. <now. laughs> but yeah, sometimes it feels like that, dude. You're just put in a position where it's like, this is. I just hope I get the stock trait, bro. <laughs> like, yeah. Like sometimes it's it's really good to even just put yourself in those situations. You yeah. Know? Yeah. Like going for header as we fit when you're off stage. Again, even though Marth can edge guard you, you might you might get something. You might get yeah. something. And right there, Houston going for the header spike, trying to get the stock there for that punish meteor, overshooting just a tad bit. Yo, I, I love I love Houston's play when he has somebody cornered. Yeah. It's so clean. It, the, the corner pressure is very, very nice coming off of Houston. Alright. Doesn't overcommit too hard, throws out like the right amount of moves. The it trouble is here is yeah. off stage, off stage has been the bane of this set. And Meteor much. is keep, keeping it very close off stage, so it's honestly not even giving Houston enough time to deep breathe. Yeah. Like, Houston has to get, oh, the pivot, pivot boost. F2. Yeah, that was so nice, especially with the deep breathing buff as yes. well. And he ran that, so fast. That, that forward tilt doesn't have a lot of range, so he had to do the pivot boost mm -hmm. to get in range of that. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Scary situation. And Houston playing so well in the corner, oh, but... The spot dodge cancel up B. <laughs> Into my invincible attack. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. Invincibility, true combo, and invincibility. I like I'm canceling that. my invincibility to more invincibility. I like that. <laughs> so smart coming out from Meteor. Okay, now we got a one-stock piece. Yes. Game this here. is really close. Last time he was in this situation, Meteor, not only does he have the edge situation, he's Marth. Yeah. Like, he oh, can kill high. him. Oh! So much damage to Dare into the up smash. Trying to keep it going with the up air. Houston keeping all this center stage control right now. Try to get the cross up, but Meteor can't get any kind of anything going right now. Try to, to go for the sugar yeah. He gets a tipper back air, though. Oh, he's floating on him off stage. He went deep! Oh, man, but he has to go back. Houston stalling out as much time as he can. Good reaction, good reaction. Oh, yeah. Oh. Actually went for that shield grab. Oh. Tipper F smash, you are out of here. And Meteor has been on point with these tippers. 3-0 for Meteor.